As a science teacher, the safety of the students is one of your primary responsibilities. It is important to understand the types of experiences and training students have had prior to entering your classroom. Have they been in a science laboratory before? Which pieces of science equipment are students familiar with? Have they operated the eye face wash or drench shower in previous schools? Do they know how to prevent accidents from happening or how to respond when they do happen? According to the Texas Education Agency and Skills for High School Science, students are expected to demonstrate safe practices during laboratory and field investigations, as well as demonstrate knowledge of conservation of resources and proper use of disposal of materials. Some TEKS for courses, such as chemistry and environmental systems, contain additional student expectations for chemical safety or first aid safety during field investigations. The implications for science teachers and students is that safety awareness, training, and practice is highly important as we proceed in exploring science content and concepts throughout the year. Both teachers and students have responsibilities in the classroom to monitor and maintain safe conditions, practices, and processes. Many of the responsibilities overlap since teachers must inform and train students to actively maintain their awareness of safety considerations during lab investigations. The chart below describes the roles and responsibilities of both teachers and students. Review the information in the chart to better acquaint yourself with each responsibility descriptor. It is also a good idea to provide students with a written set of safety rules and a contract for both the student and the parent to sign. Links to the safety contracts can be found in this training and on the staff resources page of the NEISD Science website.